Good evening, everybody, and welcome back to my channel. Thank you guys so much for watching. Thank you guys so much for your likes and your subscribes. And also, thank you guys so much for your comments as well. This is going to be a general reading for my Pisces Nation this evening. So if you are a Pisces or you have Pisces in your birth chart or you would just like to cross watch, then this is going to be the reading for you. Guys, please keep in mind that these are general readings. So these readings may resonate with you and they may not resonate with you. Take the things that do resonate with you and the things that do not resonate with you. Please ignore them because those are possibly messages for someone else that's the Pisces as well. All right. If anybody would like to book a personal reading with me, I'm going to leave my email down in the description box below so that you can hit me up and we can get you something scheduled. All right. Let's go ahead and jump right into it and see what messages that spirit has for you guys today. Spirit, what is the energy surrounding Pisces today? Show me clearly, please. Thank you, spirit. So we have deal. We have deal. So somebody's going to try to bargain with you about something, make some type of deal with you about something. I just heard that somebody's trying to get a new car and you're going to get a good deal on a new vehicle or something like that. Spirit, what is the energy surrounding Pisces? What does Pisces need to know, Spirit? Show me clearly. Thank you, Spirit. So we have air, seek union, mind, and spirit. And then we have the shield. You are safe from harm. So you guys are going to be safe from harm. And you guys need to seek a union of mind and spirit. I'm also getting that somebody could be dealing with maybe a Libra, a Gemini, or maybe an Aquarius. And this Gemini, Libra, or possible Aquarius is going to try to make a deal with you uh, about something or something like that. Somebody, you have a new relationship coming towards you. You may have already met this person. If you have not already met this person, you're going to meet this person. Spirit, what does Pisces need to know? Please show me clearly. What is the energy surrounding Pisces? Thank you, Spirit. All right, so we have concern and we have high honor. So somebody's very concerned about something or someone. There's a very false person around you. Could possibly be this air sign, this Libra, Gemini, or Aquarius. There's somebody around you that's fake. Okay, you guys don't see this coming. Spirit, tell me more about the energy for Pisces. Show me clearly what does Pisces need to know, Spirit. Thank you. So this is also possibly a lover. So somebody could be in a relationship with the person or in a courtship with the person that's a Libra, Gemini, maybe an Aquarius. Um, and this person's trying to bargain with you about something or make a deal with you about something. But what I keep on hearing is it's a vehicle. Somebody's going to get a good deal on a car. Somebody's going to go to the car lot. But others of you, um, you could be possibly married to this person that you're concerned about. There's possibly this air sign over here. Spirit, tell me more about this energy surrounding Pisces. What does Pisces need to know, Spirit? Thank you. All right. So somebody, somebody's concerned uh, about a pregnancy or somebody's concerned about being pregnant or somebody just found out that they are pregnant or something like that. And um, this is going to bring like a big change about into your life, this pregnancy. Um, and somebody's concerned about this pregnancy or I'm, I'm getting that somebody's concerned about being pregnant. 
I'm also seeing that somebody is, is actually transitioning into a new change in their life or a new phase in their life. Um, somebody's making a lot of improvements in their life right now as well. And somebody's also concerned that they aren't making any improvements right now. But Spirit is here to let you know if you are that person watching this and you're concerned about your life and like if you're wondering if you're improving or um, you don't think you're getting anywhere or something like that, Spirit wants to let you know that you are making improvements. And if you do not see those improvements, you will start to see a change and you will see those improvements very soon. Somebody um, lost something or something like that or something got stolen from you or something like that or uh, you took some type of loss. Spirit wants you to know that this loss that you're concerned about uh, that you took or whatever occurred with this loss, Spirit wants you to know that you're going to have a renewal. So whatever was taken from you or whatever you lost, it's going to be renewed, okay? So... Uh, it's going to be renewed. Spirit, tell me more about the energy surrounding Pisces. Show me clearly, Spirit. Thank you. Yeah. Okay. So. Somebody's dealing with or could possibly be dealing with a Taurus that's very bossy. Very forceful, overly protective, or something like that. This person like tries to is very controlling or something like that. This person probably treats you like you know you're a child or something like that. I'm getting. Spirit, tell me what else. Thank you. All right, so this person that you're in this courtship with right now or this relationship or whatever it is that you have going on with this person, for some of you, it's a marriage. Your person is acting different. Um, Y'all's relationship is starting to become more complex and, and you're you're not, you know, this relationship is, is very fragile. You got clarity on something that went on in this relationship, okay? Your partner started to act different and you're starting to get clarity on something that's going on. For somebody, there's there's another woman here. And that's the reason why your partner is acting different. Spirit, tell me more about the energy surrounding Pisces. What exactly does Pisces need to know, Spirit? Show me clearly. All right, yes. So we have the Three of Cups here. This is about um, celebration, friendship, happiness. But this is also about um, like growth and the first stages of completion or something like that. So somebody is actually celebrating or um, is very happy about this pregnancy that they just found out about. Somebody's concerned that they're pregnant, but somebody also has just recently found out that they were pregnant and you guys are, you know, real happy about it. And, you know, you, you done uh, shared this uh, special news with your friends um, and some of your family members. So congratulations. Somebody is uh, what you don't see coming, Pisces. I have the nine of swords at the bottom of the deck. Somebody is suffering in some type of way, okay? Somebody is hiding a pregnancy or something like that. Somebody's keeping this pregnancy a secret and worry and hope that don't nobody find out about this, uh, this pregnancy. Or maybe this person that you are pregnant by you hope that they don't find out about it or something like that. Yeah. I'm also getting that somebody. Okay. Thank you, spirit. So somebody here, I just heard that. Somebody here is faking a pregnancy. Okay. Somebody's faking a pregnancy here. And they're hoping that the, the that you don't find out, Pisces. 
So, there's a woman here. Um, that is 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 lying about being pregnant. Somebody's dealing with a married man. So somebody's in a courtship, okay, with somebody that you don't know is married. Okay. There's a woman here that's in a relationship with a man. And, and and if you're a Pisces woman watching this, you're in some type of relationship or you, you've been dealing with a man or you've been entertaining a man. And uh, what you don't see coming is that this man is married. Okay? This man has a wife. And that's why this man started to act different with you. Like, he probably doing weird shit like... You know, going days without talking to you or something like, and he didn't used to do that. And now he's starting to disappear a lot. And, you know, he always got an excuse or something like that. He just started to act different and you can't quite put your finger on why. And it's because he's married. He has a wife. Um, okay. This man has a wife. And like I said, somebody, somebody stole something from you as well. When whatever this person, whatever was taken from you, Pisces, is going to be, uh you're going to get it back. It's going to be renewed. But back to what I was saying. Uh, so there's a woman here that's pregnant. I mean, that's that's very infertile. There's a woman that's infertile. So somebody is in a relationship or dealing with a woman right now. This is for my male Pisces. Somebody is dealing with a woman that's, that's telling you she's pregnant. And she's lying about being pregnant and she's concerned about you finding out. This woman is infertile. It's like either her tubes are tied or she can't have any kids or something like that. But this woman is infertile. She can't make any more babies. But she has told you that she's pregnant. Okay? And she's concerned about you finding out that she's not pregnant. She's trying to, you know what I'm saying, keep control over this relationship. She's trying to force you to be in this relationship with her or stay in this relationship with her or something like that. She thinks that you, so you're, you're a very high value man. Thank you, spirit. If you're a Pisces man, you could possibly be dealing with an air sign woman that's a Libra Gemini or maybe an Aquarius. This woman is lying to you about being pregnant. She's not re really pregnant. She can't even have any kids anymore. Um, and she, she could be a Taurus as well, or maybe an Aries. But but heavy on the Aquarius. Uh, yeah, this woman thinks you're a very high-valued man, uh, Mr. Pisces. And she's sitting up here trying to keep you around with this pregnancy. Like, you know, she's trying to, like, force you to stay in this shit or force you into this shit or something like that. Okay? And she she's hiding a secret from you. And she's worrying about you finding out on something like that. Spirit, clarify this three of cups. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah. So what it is, thank you, Spirit. I have the eight of cups here in reverse. So you don't deal with this woman anymore. You left this woman alone or something like that. You left this woman behind. And this woman wants to try one more time with you. So she trying to make a deal with you. Remember when I told you that it was either somebody that you was dealing with that's an air sign that's trying to make some type of deal with you? Well, this is it. This woman is faking the pregnancy because she wants to try one more time with you. She wants to deal with you again. She wants you back. And I'm also getting that for somebody. somebody now, this is not going to be for everybody, but for somebody, this woman that you was dealing with, you walked away from her and quit dealing with her because she had you in a third-party situation. Or something like that. Okay. Uh, this woman could have been married. Or she could have been. She she could have had a man that she had been in a relationship with for a really long time. And, and she had you in some type of third party situation or something like that. And um, you walked away from her. And she want to try one more time. Like she want to try to keep you around because you're a very high value man. 
Yeah, I can't make this shit up. I have the magician here at the bottom of the deck. This woman is very manipulative. Um, this woman is very narcissistic, okay? This woman is very insecure, and she don't know what else to do to keep you around. So she's trying to manipulate you with this fake pregnancy to try to keep you in this relationship until she can figure out a way to do something to keep you there or, you know, change your mind and make you want to stay there. You know what I'm saying? So you, you be mindful of that. Yeah. You're going to recover what was taken from you, okay? You got the Ten of Swords here in reverse uh, at the bottom of the deck, okay? Whatever uh, somebody took from you or stole from you, uh, that Pisces person on here that, that had somebody that stole something from you, you're going to recover it. You're going to get whatever was taken from you back times 10. Spirit, clarify this Eight of Cups in reverse, please. What does Pisces need to know? Show me clearly, spirit. Thank you. So, yeah, we have the Ace of Pentacles here. This is about your abundance, okay? This is you, Pisces. You have this Ace of Pentacles. You are this man. You got this new financial opportunity that brought you in a whole lot of abundance and uh, prosperity. You, you got the big money right here. You're the Ace of Pentacles. You're the big money. And that's the reason why this woman that's so concerned about this pregnancy that she's faking don't want you to find out. I just told you guys that you are a very high honor man. For some of y'all, y'all are a boss at work or what y'all do. For some of y'all, y'all are bosses in your own business and you run your own businesses. And uh, that's why you got the big money like that. Um, you make boss moves. And this female is trying to keep you around because you are a high honor, a high value man or a high honor man uh, to her. And she wants to keep you around for uh, these manipulative reasons and stuff like that. So she's trying to manipulate you with this, this fake pregnancy because you got all the money. Okay. There was a tower moment between you and this woman. You walked away from this woman for whatever your reasons were. For some of you, it was because she had you in a third-party situation. For others of you, um, you just wasn't feeling her like that or something like that. Spirit, tell me more about the energy surrounding Pisces. Show me clearly, Spirit. What does Pisces need to know? Thank you, Spirit. Yeah, so we have the page of wands in reverse. This is about somebody that's procrastinating. Somebody that's going to create a whole lot of conflict, okay? This is about somebody that's lacking direction. That's this person, okay? They're procrastinating because they know that they're lying to you and they know that they need to tell you. Yeah, for some of y'all, y'all walked away from this person because they was had you in a third-party relationship. And for others of you, Pisces, you was juggling this woman with another woman or, mo or multiple women or something like that. And she's trying to keep you there with her so that you can choose her. So she's lying about a pregnancy as well. Spirit, clarify this page of wines. Thank you. Yeah. For some of y'all, y'all became overburdened with this shit. You ready to bring this shit to an end. You don't want to be in that shit dealing with dealing with whatever this situation is, okay? You don't want to be dealing with that. But this woman is definitely uh, lying about being pregnant. Now, there is somebody here that is pregnant for real. But if you are a Pisces man, there is a woman that you were dealing with that told you she was pregnant. And she's, telling, she's not telling you the truth. Spirit, clarify this ten of wands, please. She could possibly be a Sagittarius, too. Thank you, Spirit. So you have the Three of Swords in reverse, and then you have the Four of Swords. So, yeah, you ended things with this woman, and this woman is trying to forcefully make you um, come back and deal with her again or forcefully keep you in this relationship, and you're ready to, you've recovered, and you're ready to move on, okay? Um, you're ready to retreat from this shit. You want something new. You don't want to deal with this earth sign. It's real heavy on the earth sign. You 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 want to end things or you did end things. And this woman is trying to keep you around because you're a very high value man. Spirit, tell me more. What is the energy surrounding Pisces? Thank you, Spirit. Yes. Okay, so we have the lovers here. So for somebody, you are dealing with a Gemini. Very harmonious relationship. 
um, a lot of great sex, a lot of passionate sex, a lot of passion in the relationship. Um, there's a deep love uh, for, you know, the two of you have a deep love or something like that. Spirit clarify lovers. But when somebody started acting different, your partner, your person started acting different. Yeah. Your person started acting different. Uh, Pisces, you're going to recover from some type of financial situation that you were in. You're going to you're going to recover from that. OK, whatever financial loss you took, like I said, somebody, somebody, somebody stole something from you. And I, I'm hearing that it was money or something like that. Somebody got robbed or something like that. And you're going to recover everything that these people took from you. Everything that you lost um, financially, you're going to re you're going to recover that. You're getting ready to recover from a financial loss, okay? Your your finances is getting ready to improve. Spirit, clarify this five of pentacles in reverse. Somebody's definitely dealing with a Taurus woman, too. It's heavy on the Taurus and heavy on the Aries. I mean, uh, Aquarius. Thank you, Spirit. All right. So we have the three, we have the three of pen, the three of wands for you guys. Okay. So this is about growth and overseeing the opportunity. So somebody's going to oversee an opportunity that's going to bring you like, yeah, there's, there's that deal again. Somebody's going to make a deal. You're going to oversee an opportunity. Somebody's going to like get a new job or something like that. And it's going to expand your uh, finances. It's gonna you're gonna grow. You're gonna grow financially. Your finances are gonna expand with this new uh, opportunity that you're gonna oversee. And I can't make this shit up, you guys. You have the moon here at the bottom of the deck, Pisces. This is you. The moon card is the Pisces card. Okay, this is a Piscean card right here. The moon. This is about illusions. Okay, this is about bullshit and lies. Okay. This is about illusion. This is about mystery, okay? Uh, yeah, this person do not want you to know, but yeah, they, they selling you a dream. This girl is not really pregnant, okay? She actually is infertile, and she can't even have any kids. And she's just lying to you about being pregnant because she wants to keep you around. She's trying to forcefully keep you in this relationship with her or in this situation with her by lying about this baby because you are a high value man or high value man and or you you know you're a very high honorable man. You got a lot going for yourself or something like that and this lady don't want you to move don't want you to move around from with her because of your financial status. Spirit clarify this three of wands. Thank you spirit. Yeah, the four of wands. This person wants to come back home or something like that. Yeah. This person want to come back and deal with you again. They're trying to force you to take them back. Like I told y'all, for somebody, y'all already walked away from this person and this person want to try try one more time with you. They want another chance with you because you got all this money and you got the big money, okay? And so she lying about a baby because she trying to get your attention and she wants your attention. You know, she wants you to be with her. That's what's going on right now. Yeah, this, this chick is very toxic. You have the devil here at the bottom of the deck. This chick is very toxic. This chick has an attachment to you, okay? Uh, she has very destructive behavior, very materialistic and codependent on you, very fucking toxic. And she's lying about this baby because she's trying to keep you around. She's trying to keep you around. That's what she's got going on right now. Spirit, tell me more about what else is going on with Pisces. May I please have some more messages for Pisces, Spirit? Show me clearly. Thank you, Spirit. So we have family room. Spirit, may I please have some more messages for Pisces? What is the energy surrounding them? What do they need to know, Spirit? Thank you. So we have a mature man. So somebody here could be dealing with a mature man, or you might be an older mature man, uh, male Pisces that's watching, okay? But what I'm hearing is that somebody is dealing with the older man. This also could be somebody's father as well. Spirit, tell me more about the energy surrounding Pisces, please. 
What does Pisces need to know? Thank you, Spirit. So somebody's very dissatisfied with work. Somebody's very unhappy with their job right now. Somebody feels like their job is just, you're fucking sick of it. You're fucking sick of it. You hate it and you wish you didn't have to go. That's what, that's what I'm hearing. All right, Spirit, what is, tell me more about this energy surrounding Pisces. What does Pisces need to know? What does Pisces need to know, Spirit? Thank you. So somebody started to see something clearly about a family member or something like that. Your gut is trying to tell you something about a family member. So this could be a father, maybe an uncle or something like that. I'm not sure. But there's a family member around you that, um, you know, your intuition is telling you that it's just something about this family member that, you know, that's not right or something like that. It's something up with one of your family members and your intuition is trying to tell you that Pisces. Spirit, tell me more about this energy surrounding Pisces. Show me clearly what does Pisces need to know. Thank you, Spirit. So we have Birdcage. So, yes, like I said, for somebody, you could be an older Pisces man. And I also just heard that somebody wants freedom from this older man. This older man is very jealous. So, somebody on here, there's a younger woman, there's a younger Piscean woman. That's dealing with the older man. This older man is very possessive. And clingy and and jealous. Yeah, and he wants to control you. He does control you. And you want freedom from this old ass man. Yeah. But you're codependent on this man because he takes care of you. You want to free yourself from this man, but you can't because he take care of you. You feel like he holding you hostage. This man watches everything that you do as well. Like he's very possessive and controlling, and he don't he don't want um, you to like go nowhere and do anything or something like that. But this man is very wealthy. Like this man has a lot of money. This man is very abundant. He has a lot of money. This man uh, has plenty of resources. Like, this man helps you with everything. Yeah, this man does pretty much a lot for you. He does everything for you or something like that. Spirit, tell me more about this energy surrounding Pisces. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah. Somebody really, really, really thinks that this relationship with this man is toil and labor. Like, you feel like it's too much work or something like that to deal with this man. He's too controlling. Like, he want to be your daddy type of shit. He feel like that because he's older than you or something like that, that he can tell you what to do. And this man want to control everything you do. He want to control where you go, how long you finna be there, when you got to come back. And you feel so trapped. You feel trapped. And you know you need to leave, but you feel like you're trapped there because he got a lot. He, 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 he has all the money. Yeah, and you feel trapped there. 
Spirit, tell me more about this energy surrounding Pisces, please. Thank you, Spirit. Somebody's been doing a lot of praying about a money situation. Spirit wants you to know that you have prosperity heading towards you. Somebody's been manifesting wealth and wishing for uh, a blessing uh, or wishing for, you know, things to get better financially. Spirit wants you to know that your wishes are about to be granted. You're about to receive those blessings of abundance. Just continue to be patient, okay? Because uh, the most highest timing is perfect timing, and all your hard work is getting ready to pay off, okay? Somebody's been hoping and praying and wishing, and those hopes and wishes and prayers are about to be answered, okay? So get ready. This, man this wealth that you've been manifesting, Pisces, is coming. It's on the way, all right? Get ready for it. Be expecting it, because get ready for it. It's coming for you. Spirit, what else? You are about to have all your uh, blessings coming towards you. Lots of abundance. Lots of prosperity. Thank you, Spirit. Okay, so you have two cards. Yeah, some of you guys have been feeling real lost because of this financial situation, this financial loss that you took. Like I said, I keep hearing that somebody got robbed or something like that. But don't worry about it because you're going to regain everything that was taken from you. These you, somebody's been done had a lot of delays, a lot of complexes in your life. Things have been real complicated for you. Um, you guys have been on a spiritual quest. You've been praying. Uh, like I said, you've been hoping, wishing, and praying that the Most High come through and bless you. Okay, some of you guys feel like you're in a catch twenty two type of situation. Like you feel like it's not no type of solution to your problem, but there is going to be a solution to your problem, you guys, because. You guys have, like I said, more clarification of abundance. We have grapes. We have abundance. You guys are getting ready to bear fruit, okay? You guys are getting ready to see your harvest set in, all right? You guys are getting ready to see prosperity. Like, for real. You guys are going to have plenty. You, you got wealth coming towards you. You guys are getting ready to enjoy the fruits of your labor. So I know some of you guys have been feeling a little lost in the sauce right now because of all these delays and this complexity that's been going on in your life and stuff like that. And, you know, it seems like things been spiraling out of control. And a lot of y'all have been praying and manifesting these things. Spirit wants y'all to know that these manifestations are complete. Okay, you got the ace of pentacles, you got the big money coming. These 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 manifestations are about to be complete, you guys. Okay, minus the bullshit, life's great. Minus the bullshit, life's great. Spirit, tell me more about the energy surrounding Pisces. Show me clearly. What does Pisces need to know, Spirit? What does Pisces need to know, Spirit? Thank you. Yeah. We have eyeglasses. So, somebody needs, like I said, okay, remember when I told you guys that somebody was going to try to make a deal with you? Um... I'm, I'm hearing that it's something about a car or a vehicle or something like that. For others of you, this is some other type of deal. This could be like a record deal, I'm hearing. Somebody's getting ready to sign some type of record deal or something like that. Or sign some type of business contract with a, a business going into business or something like that. There's some type of paperwork or something that you're going to um, need to sign when you get ready to make this deal. Um, or accept this deal, there's going to be paperwork or something like that that you're going to have to sign. Guys, I'm hearing that you're going to have to use your best judgment on this. You guys need to read the fine print on this paperwork when you get ready to accept this deal that this person is trying to offer you, okay? Because you got a lot of money coming here, okay? And so you don't want to, you know, be doing the wrong shit. So what I'm hearing is, and you 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 know what I'm talking about, Pisces. Well, whichever Pisces that this is for, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Spirit is telling you to read the fine print. Spirit is saying you you check out all the details and look closely at that shit. Okay, use your best judgment, evaluate all your options, analyze that shit, review that shit. Don't just sign on the dotted line. 
That's what spirit is letting you know. When this person try to give you this deal, don't just accept this deal and sign off on a dotted line. Read the fine print. Read over that paperwork. Look and check and look and see. Look and read those clauses and shit. That's what spirit is letting you know, okay? When this person tries to come and make this deal with you. Your intuition is going to let you know, guys, okay? Y'all need to read the fine print, okay? And read that shit so you can see it clearly. You're going to have to read that shit and see it clearly so you won't sign away on the wrong shit. Spirit, what else does Pisces need to know? Please show me clearly. May I please have some more messages for Pisces? What is this? All right. So... Like I said, whoever has been going through these tough times where you're feeling lost, life has been real complex and hard and complicated for you and everything. You took a financial loss. For some of you guys, it was a robbery. Somebody stole your money from you and took your shit from you. For others of you, you just fell on some hard times and you just took a financial loss. Spirit wants you to know that this is the final chapter of that. That is coming to an end. You guys can start to relieve yourselves and start to feel more relieved because you're going to have a positive outcome, okay? There's going to be a completion to your financial problems, your financial issues, whatever financial burdens that you have been concerned about. Spirit says that's going to come to an end, all right? You're going to start to see some more positive results. Somebody is most definitely about to have a new beginning, okay? Somebody's also definitely pregnant and getting ready to have a new baby. There's going to be a birth of a child. Now, this is for, um, this is not for that one Pisces man that's dealing with that woman that's pregnant. And she's telling you, she, no, nah, not you. Because sis is lying. She can't even have no kids. But like I told you guys in the beginning, somebody was concerned about being pregnant. Um, and uh, recently found out that they were pregnant and they are being concerned about that because of their money problems. But Spirit is here to let you know that you're going to have a new beginning and a fresh start. Okay, and you're going to have a baby. There is going to be the birth of a child and you're going to be going through a new phase in your life. But it's going to be for the greater good. It's going to bring you lots of abundance and prosperity. You're going to birth fruit. You're going to start to enjoy the fruits of your labor. You're going to have lots of prosperity coming your way. You're going to have blessings and abundance coming your way. Okay, you just need to have patience and trust the most high. Right. Spirit, may I please have another message for Pisces? Thank you. Yeah. So, there's somebody that wants you to hear the amount of Pisces. Somebody that you walked away from or that you don't deal with anymore or something like that, they want to make amends with you. They want you to hear the amount. They want to talk to you, okay? They want to balance some shit out. They want to tell you the truth about some shit. They want to tell you the truth about some shit. Somebody that crossed you that you had to cut off. Could be an earth sign as well. Thank you, spirit. So we have optical illusion. Something is not what it seems. So this person that's acting like they're wanting to come back to make amends. This person is, is that's, that shit is fake. Okay. It's a trick. And I'm also getting for somebody, you need to, uh, somebody needs to watch out. That woman that's, that's faking this pregnancy and shit. I told you guys it was an illusion. She's lying about being pregnant. Okay. That lady is lying. And I'm also getting that this lady tried to spell you. Because this lady is so desperate to keep you around. That this lady tried to spell you. Okay? This lady tried to spell you to keep you there. She tried to spell you to keep you there. Okay? This woman is using magic. Hocus pocus. To try to keep you around. 
And she's also lying about this child as well. So whoever this is, be mindful of this woman. This woman is not really pregnant. You need to tell that lady that she needs to show you some type of paperwork or something like that. To let you know that she's pregnant because she's not going to be able to prove that because she's telling a lie. She's telling a lie. All right, let me get... um. Let me get some more messages for you guys before I let you go. See what other messages that Spirit has for you guys. Spirit, what other messages do you have for um, Pisces? Please show me clearly. What other messages do you have for Pisces before I let them go, Spirit? Thank you. You see that? You have moon. Moon again. All right? This is about illusion. Okay? Y'all be mindful of this woman. She's lying. You need to defend yourself. You're going to have to defend yourself from this person because she lying and she trying to put hocus pocus on you. This, this woman trying to spell you and use magic against you. Spirit, tell me more. Thank you. Somebody's going to have a new opportunity and possibility and paths are opening up for you. I told you guys I can't make this shit up. I told you guys that you guys had blessings coming towards you. Some wishes are going to be fulfilled. You have abundance coming towards you. Good luck. You're manifesting wealth. Prosperity is coming towards you. You're going to get new opportunities, possibilities, and paths are going to be opening up for you, Pisces. So minus the bullshit, life is great, okay? Like I said, for, for that person, that is... um, And also, somebody's going to have somebody new is going to be entering into your life. That's going to be that new baby. That's for you. Uh, that's for the person on here that's pregnant and concerned about being pregnant and worrying about money. You don't have to worry about money, sweetie. Spirit got it all uh, under control for you, honey. You're going to be fine. Your baby's going to be fine. Everything is going to be fine. And Spirit wants you to know that. The bulk of this reading, the most important message that Spirit has for you, Pisces, is that I know that things have been stagnant for you. I know that you have suffered from some delays. So some of you guys have suffered from major financial losses. For somebody, you got taken from you via robbery or theft. For others of you, you just fell on some hard times. You started to, you know, um, have problems at work, uh, getting laid off or you lost your job or something like that. You suffer some type of financial loss in some type of way. Spirit wants you to know that you're going to have a recovery of that, okay? You're going to have a renewal of your finances. Your finances will be recovered. Everything that you lost and was taken away from you is going to be recovered. You're going to have abundance. You're going to have prosperity and good luck. You got blessings on top of blessings that's coming. That's what this bulk of this reading was all about. Um... And that's the bottom line, you guys. That's the that's the, pretty much the message. You guys have new opportunities coming towards you. New possibilities and new paths are opening up for you guys. So if you've been worried, this message for you today, Pisces, is to do not worry. Don't sweat the bullshit, okay? Minus the bullshit, life's great. Your manifestations are complete, okay? You guys have been manifesting out of these things. You've been praying for these things. You've been asking the most high for these things. You've been manifesting these things. And Spirit wants you to know that your manifestations are complete. I hope you guys enjoyed this message. If you have not already subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button below for me. Thank you guys so much for uh, watching and for all of you who have already subscribed. Thank you so much and welcome to my channel. And I hope you guys have a wonderful evening. Peace.